When you think of apex predators, you probably imagine sharks, lions, or wolves, right? But what if I told you that one of the most dangerous predators in the sub-Antarctic region is something you might find in your living room, a cat? On France's remote Kerguel Island, feral cats have evolved into deadly hunters. And today we are going to explore how these ex-house cats became the top killers on this desolate island. Kerguelen Island is an isolated and windswept land located deep in the southern Indian Ocean. It's part of the French Southern and Antarctic lands and is home to a unique ecosystem, including seabirds like the wandering albatross. These majestic birds have no natural crown predators, or at least they didn't, until the arrival of humans and their cats. Feral gats were first introduced to Kerguelen in the early 20th century, brought by sailors and scientists who needed companions and a way to control the island's rodent population. What they didn't expect was that these domestic cats would adapt to their new environment, evolving into the island's most efficient predators. The environment on Kerguelen is harsh, with cold winds, rough seas and little in terms of vegetation. For these feral cats, surviving meant adapting, and adapt they did. Without easy access to rodents, the cats quickly turned to the most abundant prey on the island, crowned nesting seabirds. Uh, wandering albatrosses, petrels and other bird species that evolved without the threat of land predators suddenly found themselves vulnerable. The cats began preying on eggs and chicks, devastating bird populations. The wandering albatross, in particular, has been a major target. These birds lay their eggs on the ground and the chicks are left defenseless for long periods while their parents are out at sea hunting. The cats with their natural stealth and agility have become expert hunters. What's particularly shocking is how these cats have evolved and adapted to maximize their hunting efficiency in this new environment. While the original goal of introducing cats to control the rodent population made sense at the time, the unint unintended consequences have been catastrophic for the island's ecosystem. These once domesticated animals have transformed into turbo-evolving apex predators. Over the past decades, the cats have learned to survive in an unforgiving environment by becoming highly specialized seabird hunters. Some cats have even been seen scaling cliffs to reach nests and their hunting techniques have become increasingly refined. As if living on a natural evolutionary fast track, these cats have become almost perfectly suited to their new roles as predators. The impact on Kerguelen's bird populations has been devastating. According to the conservationists, the predation by feral cats has resulted in the decline of numerous bird species on the island. Particularly troubling is the toll of the wandering albatross, a species already vulnerable due to other environmental factors such as climate change and longline fishing. Efforts to control or eliminate the feral cat population have proven difficult. Kerguelen's remote location and unforgiving weather makes any large-scale er eradication efforts a logistical nightmare. So it looks like, for the better or worse, the island's new apex predators are there to stay.